A research submarine has a 10 centimeter diameter window that is 9 centimeters thick. The manufacturer says the window can withstand forces of up to 1 times 10 to the 6 newtons. What a submarine's maximum safe depth in seawater and the pressure inside of the submarine is maintained at 1 atm. So we have our window here. And they tell us the diameter is equal to 10 centimeters. Put that in SI right away. We have 0 0.1 meters. And they tell us that this window is 9 centimeters thick. We'll say inside over here is inside, and they say that's 1 atm. And we don't know what the pressure is out here. So let's write the equation. There's a relationship. So pressure is equal to a force divided by the area. And then we can also say that pressure is equal to in liquid rho or the density of liquid times gravity times the depth that we're at. So essentially we're saying how dense is it and all that density of the liquid is getting pulled down by gravity is roughly what rho GD is talking about. So um, we can use this relationship and we can do it two ways. We could first figure out the maximum safe pressure. So they tell us that F is equal to 1 times 10 to the 6 newtons. And we can figure out the area of the circle, which is pi times the radius squared. So the area of the circle is 0 0.00785 meters squared. So if we took this force and divided it by this area, we would know the maximum pressure that we could have out here. And then we could set that that pressure equal to rho g d and solve for d. That's totally fine if you want to do that in that two-step problem. Or we could also look at it this way. Since all three of these are equal to each other, why don't we just say F A is equal to rho G D. And now when we solve for D, if we divide both sides by rho times gravity, that gives us D is equal to the force divided by the area times rho times g. And that will give us the exact same answer, only this one's in one step. So whichever one you're comfortable with doesn't really matter, it will give you the same answer. So now we can plug everything in. D is equal to the force, which we say is 1 times 10 to the 6th newtons, divided by the area, which we just figured out. I'm going to put it in this way. And because this is a rounded answer, so if we times this um, a pi times the radius squared is 0 0.05 meters meters squared. If we times that, now we'll get a, a more accurate answer. So we times that by 9.8 for gravity, and rho for seawater is 1030 kilograms per cubic meter. So when we plug all that in, the maximum safe depth that that submarine can go with that window is 12,614 meters or 1.3 times 10 to the 4 meters.